Do you believe that any other Republican, if they were to become president, would be treated more fairly than Donald Trump? Does anyone actually believe that? Do you believe that they're gonna pull it back? Anyone out there who thinks that this is a Donald Trump problem is completely delusional. All right, let's see. Oscar goes to Brad Pitt. Yes! yes! Yeah! Yeah! Good Woo! for him. Okay, this is starting off there pretty we well. Go. This is starting off pretty well. Oscar. I'm very happy Good, about I'm that. happy with that. Thank you to the Academy for this honor of honors. They told me I only have 45 seconds up here, which is 45 seconds more than the Senate gave John Bolton this week. Oh, oh now I'm not great. happy. Right. I'm thinking maybe Quentin does a movie about it. In the end, the adults do the right thing. Can we uh, drink again, everybody? There we go. Yeah, another big John And he Bolton just family. undid all of the goodwill in this room. Yeah, dude. <laughs> you are Tom, sit robbed. down. Shut up, sit down. Uh, uh, the, the film industry would be... Hey, quick, someone bring up a quote from anyone in Hollywood about John Bolton before this last week. <laughs> right, yeah. <laughs> anyone. Yeah. Hey, also, anyone bring up a quote from any of these people on Mitt Romney before last right. week. Let me exactly. be really clear about this, people. And by the way, we don't know if this will be removed. You can go watch the blaze.com slash mug club. Mitt Romney, Bolton... I know right now you think these people are your friends and you want to get in with a cool club like David French. Was it David French or French George? David French, David Billy French. Crystal, French the Russell. other one. Yeah. Not the good host, the, the wiener. <laughs> the bad one, and yeah. uh, and uh, Rick Wilson. They're not your friends. Do you, let me ask you this, this question. Do you genuinely think that these people, or the Democrats, because they're one and the same, let's be honest, they all hang out yeah. at the same dinners, the multimedia uh, entertainment industrial complex, is one and the same with the Democratic Party. Does anyone actually believe that, let's say Donald Trump were impeached and the Senate did it and Mike Pence became president, or if, let's just remove Mike Pence from the equation. Do you believe that any other Republican, if they were to become president, would be treated more fairly than Donald Trump? Does anyone actually believe that? Do you believe that they're going to pull it back? They did the no. same thing with George W. Bush, that he was a Nazi. They yeah. did the same thing when Mitt Romney was running. Binders full of women. The right, fact yep. that he had his, uh, his dog kennel uh, on top of the car, which I will grant kind of weird. I don't know. Maybe it's Mormon <laughs> well, thing. Yeah, well, I'm not one to judge their culture. But now these people act like, well, it's time to be Americans and find common ground. You're finding common ground with people who will abandon you, discard you, and paint you out to be the same evil Nazi that they do Donald Trump. Appeasing crocodiles is futile. I don't know why no. these people don't get it. Anyone, you need to understand, this isn't about Donald Trump right now. No. This is no, about no. any other Republican yep. yeah. from 2020 thereafter. They've set the precedent now. This is the first time an impeachment like this has gone on for admitted non-impeachable crime. Right. There was no way. I just am amazed that people now, they're like, oh, John Bolton. Listen, I disagree with him, but he was an American hero, John yeah. Bolton. Hey, yeah. listen, since I when? disagree with Mitt Romney on policy, but he's a decent man. Real, yeah, since, since when? when? Since yeah. when? Did you do that in the election? Because I remember yeah. you calling him a Nazi. I remember what exactly. you did with Rick Santorum, by the way, who, are, whether you agree with him or not, you would have to admit probably the most respectable family man if you look into his yes. past with scandal. And instead, you decided to absolutely destroy tar and feather his reputation his name anyone out there who thinks that this is a donald trump problem is completely delusional and i say this by the way as someone i always make sure to stress not because i want to uh, cover my own ass that i was not a trump supporter in the primaries why because i want you to know that i was more wrong about that than anything in my life in the sense that i didn't think he was going to win i said there was no way he was going to win michigan I was wrong, so wrong. I want to be clear about that. I admit it, I apologize for it, and right now people think that Donald Trump is a lightning rod. No, the Democrats losing is the lightning rod. They yeah. thought after Barack Obama that they, the tides were turning, the pendulum had shifted. Remember they were talking about how yeah. no Republican yeah. would ever be president again exactly. because yep. the politics yeah. had shifted and Barack Obama had shaken up the map? Yep. The, this is a baby right now being put to sleep in its crib who is just He's in his throes of, no, I don't want to take a nap, and is acting like a spoiled brat. It has nothing to do with the fact that President Donald Trump is the one putting them in their crib. Yeah. Okay? No. <laughs> Let me ask you this. Would you be pushing for John Bolton to get airtime if it were anything other than no. impeaching Donald Trump? Well, and by right. the way, who, anything ever. Impeaching Mike Pence. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah exactly. exactly. Right after Donald Trump, exactly. of course. But here's the thing. Anybody can say something in a book. Anybody can say something in a book. Are you telling me they need to be able to go and testify at any level of government to be able to go and testify and say, well, yeah, Donald I Trump I want said this. Chelsea Handler at the hearing. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I have no I idea. No, I, 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 going back a little bit, I was just gonna, if mm -hmm. one thing, if we could just stop saying that Mitt Romney was a man of principle, 
because uh, at least politically, he has yeah. never been a man of principle. No, he hasn't. He was the uh, author so, of Obamacare, which some people forgave yes. because they're like, well, he did it on a state level. Right. And I understand that, but still, on a state level, yeah. he actually was right. not conservative in really any way, shape, or form. And I don't understand when he became pro-life. Here's the thing that doesn't make sense to me, because he was always a Mormon, yeah. and the position of the Mormon church has always been pro-life, right? Mm -hmm. Mormons are typically pro-life. So it's not like he could say, well, I had a moment of faith, right. and this was my aha moment, his right. flash of genius. Mitt Romney just was like, well, I was a Mormon my whole life, and I was principled, and I was a, a Christian conservative, but I was pro-abortion, and uh, now I'm not. Yeah, because it's politically <laughs> well, expedient. Happened? Well, I was, and then I wasn't anymore. But why? Yeah, I just, <laughs> you know, more. Tuesday. I was running for office. Yeah, he, he was a Massachusetts Mormon. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Well, the district changed. <laughs> Wait a second. Why are you now pro-life? Gerrymandering. I don't. What, what do you? What do you? I took a poll. It is just remarkable <laughs> to me that someone on this stage yeah. right now is going to act as though they are a supporter of John Bolton right. or of right. Mitt Romney. Yeah. It is so unreal to or me. The, or the, and they, I bet you they'll all claim that tonight wasn't political. That no, surprised me too. They don't see it's it as just, political when they decide to go up and take jabs at Donald Trump and at jabs right. really at half of the voting uh, population because they're just right. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, subscribe or hit the notification bell and click all notifications so that you can be notified when uh, new videos are up. I think there are videos playing in a box now. I don't really care about that much. I can hear the ocean in this mug like, uh, like, uh, like I'm listening to a, to a conch. Conch? 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 Is it conch or conch? 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 I don't know, but they really messed up Piggy.